Hello everybody and welcome back to another Techno Tokyo Theater video. It's gonna be a third video I'm recording today, so if you see me wearing a similar outfit, man, just <laughs> bear with me, man. I'm trying to make that content for you. You know what I'm saying? Here we have a loot anime uh, unboxing. This one is actually from January, but you guys probably won't get this video until March. Uh, uh, so, I mean, this is like this is like two months old now, but we're doing a little bit of catch up. So the uh, channel was actually on a little bit of a hiatus, but that's fine. There should be a February uh, loot anime unboxing coming uh, within the next few weeks. Hopefully, the box actually hasn't made it to me yet, so that's actually on a delay as well. But let's go ahead and unbox it and see what's inside. I'm sure you guys already know what a loot anime box is. It's pretty much just a bunch of random goodies that they throw into a box every month, uh, mostly themed around anime. So let's go ahead and jump in and see what items we have for this month. So uh, we're going to start with uh, this item here. Now, I'm not going to lie, I accidentally opened this box thinking it was the box from a month ago. So this is the only item in this box I actually know what it is. Let's go ahead and get a better look at it. So we have Shadow the Hedgehog figure. Fucking random, dude. What the fuck, loot anime? What the fuck, all right? You can't just throw some goddamn Japanese letters on a box and say it's anime. This ain't no fucking anime figure, man. You guys have been on a roll. And this is the first figure for a, a, a long time. Look, they even put for adult collectors only. Hold on, let, read, look at this shit, all right? For adult collectors only, this is not a toy. What do you think? You think just because you put that on the box, it makes this figure a collectible? Is that what you're, is that what you're saying? I know there's a lot of Sonic the Hedgehog fans out there, but this is clearly, this is not, this, I don't know. I'm not with this item. I'm not even going to bother unboxing it. So this is definitely going to be a giveaway item. I'm not that big of a Sonic fan and definitely not a fan of Shadow of all the characters. If they put Sonic in here, then maybe there could be a little bit uh, forgiven. And you know, you see my freaking figure collection here, right? Like, uh, clearly I'm a huge figure collector and this is not going to be a figure that's going to be in my collection. Uh, no, sir. Uh, uh, no, sir. Thank you. All right. I think I saw a felt a shirt in here, so we're going to go ahead and see what that item is next. Ugh. And it is a shirt, and it is, oh, oh, it's a fucking bad ass shirt in this motherfucking box, dude. This is from Steins Gate, dude. Yeah, but this is a fucking awesome shirt, man. Steins Gate, like, fantastic item. Um, I'm a huge fan of Steins Gate. The anime is a, it's difficult to get into at first, I'm not going to lie. Uh, like, the first 10 episodes are tough, man. Like, they're not bad, but they you kind of start to think, like, what is going on with this series? Is it actually going anywhere? But then, about at that 10 episode mark, everything changes, and you're like, God damn, this anime is good. And all those episodes in the beginning, they actually mean something, so it's kind of mandatory to watch them. But they aren't the easiest to get through. Steins Gate is fantastic. On to the next item. Uh, all right, uh oh, it's looking a little light. I, I think we got a manga here, which we, we haven't gotten. At least we didn't get a manga last month. Uh, interesting. So the next item is Final Fantasy Type Zero uh, manga. This is definitely an interesting one. It's definitely more anime than the Sonic the Hedgehog, but it's still kind of a video game. Uh, so I don't know what's going on. It's like there's there not enough anime in the world uh, For you guys to pull from or is there not enough popular anime for you guys to pull from is that what's happening? Because this game this box seems more game themed than anime themed uh, Yeah, this this is really weird guys um, Really freaking weird if you ask me, but I, I am a fan of type zero. I thought it was an amazing game uh, I played it on the PS4. I actually platinumed it. This actually might have been the very first game I ever platinumed. So that, that's, that's a good example of showing you how much I kind of like the game. I did kind of cheat on my platinum a little bit, but I found a way to get a platinum. Uh, so I mean, the, the, the art is nice in this book. It looks good. It translates well over to a, to a manga. 
Yeah, I mean, it's very interesting. I, I, this is the vo first volume, or is this just like a side story of some sort? I'm not sure. But, there you go, another giveaway item. Uh, so far, this box is looking a bit disappointing. Probably have like one item left. Ugh, I mean, we got a manga, we got a shirt, and we got a figure. The manga and the, the figure were both kind of video game themed items, not really anime. I can kind of see how you can get away with being Final Fantasy almost looking like anime because it has a similar anime art style. But where is the anime in loop anime? That is a real question. So let's go ahead and continue and see what we get next. Oh god. Oh god, no. I think this is just a pin, and I don't know. Oh damn, this <laughs> this actually might be the best fucking item in the box. Uh, and it is actually one of the better items in the box. Uh, I mean, something I definitely will use. I do like enamel pins like this. Uh, I just need to find something to put them on because I still don't really have anything to put these on. I am starting to collect quite a few enamel pins at this point in time. Ah, uh, goodness, what to do, what to do, what to do. Where did I put the other enamel pin I got from this, uh, the loot anime? I do remember getting another one not so long ago. But yeah, this one's actually much nicer than the last one we got. So this is pretty cool. This time, they actually decided to, uh, go ahead and put the, uh, put the actual anime up here. Is it wrong to pick up girls in a dungeon? I've never seen this anime, but... Goodness gracious, <laughs> Hesta, Hestia, this this busty chick right here with the with the strap around her titties. That's that girl right there started a whole fad in Japan where girls were like wrapping their titties in these like ribbons, and uh, that alone makes this anime legend because that it's created a whole new boob fashion in Japan. Uh, so that's pretty cool. I need to check out this anime. This girl, I've seen figures of her. I didn't know she was from this anime. She looks like Saber to me a lot. But, you know, whatever. That's pretty cool. I actually would encourage they actually put more anime posters in here instead of ones of, of their mascot. Ah, that would be good. Well, that was a quick, uh, short, and very painful video, actually. I, 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 <laughs> not a good loot anime. Actually, it's probably the worst one we've had in months. I just I realized the theme is actually game one. I didn't realize that at the beginning of this video. So it makes sense they have a lot of game themed items, but I don't think the, the box should be so centered on games that they kind of take away from the anime. And that's kind of what happened with this box, which is very disappointing. They were like, game on, so let's just put a lot of video game stuff. And it was very little anime stuff. There's enough animes that take place in a video game or around a video game or about a video game that they could have actually worked with. So it's kind of weird they did that. There's no Sword Arc stuff in here. I know Sword Arc and Pop has kind of died off in popularity, but they could have put some Sword Arc stuff in here. Uh, there, there is there, there's Log Horizon. There's um, what's that really old one that took place in an MMO? Uh, oh my goodness, Dot Hack. There's a lot of anime video game type animes they could have worked with and they didn't really do any of that which is really odd they just kind of actually went straight to the video game sonic i mean come on shadow the hedgehog not anime dude it's not anime thank you guys for watching this techno tokyo theater video i'm sure a lot of you guys probably already seen these boxes get unboxed but you haven't seen me unbox them so that's where the fun comes into play and uh thank you guys uh, thank you guys for all your support please like comment and subscribe if you're new to the channel and show your support, guys. I will see you in the next video. See you later. I want you for a lifetime. So if you're gonna